water and Gary fell down and broke his crown and Jill came tumbling after Gary and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water Gary fell down and broke his crown and Jill came tumbling after <laughs> That guy is so weak. Uh, let's use by the the baby gun. Oh, could actually use him. Welcome to Highway Village. Our currency here is tires, and we sacrifice our younglings to the Lord Asphaltia, High God of the Way. At first we were scared. How did we end up here? Where were we? Should we leave our highway? And it turns out the answers in order as I asked them were, I don't know, I don't know, and definitely not. It is true, we used to hate each other. Honking and shouting, fuck you, back and forth, like animals. But now, we have found community and love. Lucky you. Men. Hey, I'm the youngest one left alive. That means they're gonna sacrifice me to Lord Asphaltia tomorrow. I'm not too excited about it, to be honest, actually. Hey, I'm what not even fuck? that much younger than everyone else. I'm 45 years old. I just happen to be the youngest by a couple of months. I know everyone's happy, but we did kill a lot of children in the name of a god we only made up within the last...
poor guy. Is it okay if I don't want to shoot them? Oh, at least they they cleaned up the place. And that's good. Is that you wanted us to stay far away? Get your soul from your body. Get the egg. Okay, who are we fighting? Okay, yep, got it.
shit, it's toxic! I'm dying. Somebody. Uh, oh, thank God. Thank God someone's here. I, I'm, I'm, I'm losing consciousness. Oh, oh. We stumbled across another body. It looked like a classic case of... Hey, what happened to you? A G3 base warped right through here. Right, 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 right where I was. And, uh, well, well it shot me uh, right in half. I got cut in half. A G3 base. That could only mean one thing. Not sure what, though. Oh, God. Oh God, I'm fading fast. Please, please, please just stay with me while I die. I, I, I don't want to be alone. I don't want to be alone. Do they still have a chance of survival? Who's to say? No way to know. Not even with all the blood and half their body missing. We weren't going anywhere until it was over. No, no. It, it's my time to go. Oh, thank you for for staying with me as I die. Oh, just, just don't leave. Okay. And I feel it. Here I go. Oh, I'm, I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh. And just like that, another candle is snuffed out in the wind. So cool. Hey, 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 where, where are you guys going? You you promised me you'd stay with me until I until I die. Hey, hey thanks for coming back. Are you really dying? You, you, you sound fine now. <laughs> No, 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 oh, oh, I'm dying. No, I'm actually, oh, not uh, for real this time, though. Oh, my God, oh, stay. Hey, hey, what the fuck? You left me again. I'm, I'm not dead yet, assholes. Oh, come back and stay with me.
Hey, how are you? My name's Colby, and before you ask, no, I'm not gonna try to sell you Gooper cum or anything gross like that. I'm not anything like my two weird brothers. Oh, I'm sorry. I hope we didn't offend you. Sorry, I just, yeah, no, I, I, I'm a little sensitive. My brothers both sell weird goop and cum, and now everyone just assumes that's what I do, and I don't, I don't. I, I, I sell warp base insurance. Are, are you in the market for that? I don't think so. I wish we were. You know what? It's fine. You know, nobody ever is. You know, maybe I need to just give up and start selling goop and cum or something. Piss, I don't know. I'm gonna starve to death out here. I got some stuff to think about here. Can I just have some space? It was nice to meet you. Thank you very much. If you want to use my trick hole, feel free. Whatever's clever. Time to fuck him up. Up, motherfuckers! Come 
Because I gotta be honest, I'd rather be swimming in a bucket of piss over this toxic shit. Oh, thank God you picked me. I was scared I'd never get to see you again. Annoying shield stuff. Oh, so I guess I'm the only one who thinks these guys are cute? Back off!
hard. Yo, yo! All right, so this is Dr. Giblet's base. Then where is he at? Where's Dr. Giblet's? Oh, well, I'm sure we'll be able to find Dr. Giblet's with just a little bit of detective work. Let's look around for clues. Fine, if we have to. Oh, that's a lot of dead bodies. What do you think happened in here? Whatever it was, it's not a good situation for everyone who died. But it's great for us detectives because we need a good mystery to solve. Now go scan stuff. Hey, what are you doing? You should go back and investigate more. I hate to say it, but Sudo's right. Let's just keep looking. Someone was killing G3 mercs. You know what? That makes sense. Everyone hates the G3. I bet people try to kill them all the time. I mean, look at you. That's what you're doing. Hmm, a destroyed drone. Looks like it was deployed for combat. Nothing fishy there. That's what they're used for. That's what drones are for. They're for combat. That's not weird to see a destroyed drone. Looks like your typical work desk, nothing too crazy. Uh, uh, you know, best I can guess is someone interrupted Dr. Giblets while he was doing experiments. I don't know, I'm just throwing stuff at the wall here. Okay, yeah, I think I'm getting a sense of what happened here. Someone beat us to the punch. They attacked Dr. Giblets and all his men. Oh, we need more information. Let me hack the door so we can go deeper and look for more clues. Haha, <laughs> let's go! Cowboys? Uh, oh shit, sorry, wrong bit, wrong bit. I mean, how do they are detectives? Ooh, this looks like the lab where Dr. Giblets did his experiments. There's gotta be something helpful in here. Let's get to scanning. There's gotta be an off switch for this guy somewhere, or unplug him. I don't know. 
These must be old Hyperbong prototypes. Way jankier than the ones they're selling at the High on Life store. Well, you know, we just pointed these out. Now we can move on to the next thing. Look at all these drone heads. Dr. Giblets was an expert at creating cybernetic organisms, but we already knew that. You know, I don't think this is a very helpful clue. I do think it's neat, though. It's cool to look at fucked up drone heads. Thanks for showing me this. Was he doing experiments on his own henchmen? Jesus Christ, that's fucked up, right? Yeah, that's fucked up. I know it's fucked up. I don't know why I asked. I knew it was fucked up. Dr. Giblets must have been losing his mind. All right, here's my new theory. Dr. Giblets was even more twisted than we could ever imagine. He was torturing his own henchmen. He wasn't right in the head. Although I guess that's what Douglas did too, so maybe that's normal for the G3. Maybe he was normal. No way to know unless we go deeper. I'm hacking the next door! Okay, I think we finally cracked this case. Dr. Giblets really did go insane. He was paranoid that someone was after him, so he killed his own men. While you were wasting time doing detective work, I was busy scanning the area for Dr. Giblets and decrypting the password on his security systems. Now you can just follow the waypoint right to him. Wait a minute, so you had us do all that shit for nothing? Yep, sorry. I just love detective mode so much, I didn't want you to stop using it. Now go kill Dr. Giblets. I got no fucking idea what this room is, but I'm sure there's more clues in here, so go go find more clues, baby. Oh boy, did Dr. Giblets write this? He was really paranoid, huh? He really thought people were trying to kill him. And you know what? Uh, he, he was right, because that's exactly what we're here to do. So, okay, he was right. Not crazy. Normal guy. Are these second place trophies? They're trophies for, for what? Science? Just science in general? Do they really give out second place trophies for science? Jeez, it looks like Dr. Diblets was pissed he didn't get first place in, in science. Is that the Gatling we're looking for? They look a little busted to me. Aha! So that's our murder weapon. Dr. Giblets must have used that modified Gatlian to attack his men. It's pretty powerful. Did a lot of did a lot of damage. It'd be great if we could somehow get that Gatlian for ourselves. You think that's gonna happen? Uh, who knows? Let's find out. That's Dr. Giblets, right? Pretty anticlimactic. Jesus Christ, that was the easiest one yet. All right, let me at him. Dr. Giblets status report. No life sense detected. Entering full security lockdown. Oh, no, 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 no! Hello! If you're hearing this pre-recorded message, it means you've successfully managed to murder one of the greatest minds in all of super science. Congratulations, you killed me. But I knew this day would come and I was prepared for this moment. Now see if you can survive my retribution from beyond the grave. It's never that easy, is it? Everyone called me crazy, but look at me now. I'm dead and you're trapped in here. Bald and prey to my glorious that's right, Primothy. I know it was you. My own son killed me. The project, the inheritance, my lab, or just a plain old space edifice complex. No man. 
matter. Just as you had no qualms about killing your own father, I shall gladly spill the blood of my firstborn. Hello, Krimothy giblets! I recorded this message in the event that you're wearing a jetpack and use it during the fight. I don't really have anything to say about it. I just wanted to cover all my bases here. Good work using the jetpack. But it won't be enough! If you're hearing this, it means you just killed an enemy. This is fine. I expected you to defeat some of them. But you will lose the war. Yes. Yes, I was wrong. How could I have been so blind? I know who killed me now. It was you, Krubus. Oh, was it Krubus who killed him? Yes. These are fun audio recordings. Krubus, 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 always complaining about being the lowest rung on the G3 ladder. You thought you could kill me and take my spot to the top, didn't you? Well, think again, because... Well, you did kill me, actually, but... God, I'm gonna kill you back! A new way! How appropriate, Krivis, that after all those years stuck behind mountains of paperwork, you finally got to get your hands dirty again, just like you wanted. I really am proud of you, but you picked the wrong... dirt to get dirty with. I'm bad with analogies. Krubus, could this actually be about the time that I slept with your wife? And then convinced her to divorce you and marry me instead? And then I made her do an experiment for me and she died in that process? And you swore revenge against me for the rest of the days? Could it be that? I feel like it's probably not, but I just want to make sure. I know you can't tell me because I'm dead. But so you can tell me. I can't believe we gotta kill him. I couldn't even tell if that thing was alive. All right, I'm done now. All right, if you're still alive, you can't beat Krubus. Krubus was too weak. That would have killed him. No, no, you must be someone else. But who is it? Who killed me? Was it... You, Douglas? You never told me your last name! Oh, so it was Douglas! Bring it, mother Douglas, you always were unpredictable. Your relentless party habits always landed you in hot water with our mantuous. Perhaps you wish to strike back against our leader by killing his prize scientist, me! That would certainly hurt his feelings. But it was a mistake to think you could just walk out of here alive! Another wave! Douglas, I remember that party where you got naked and experimented with one of the Squendle brothers. It was really hot. I even took photographs. Perhaps that's why you killed me. To get back those photographs. Well, too bad. I rigged my computer to post them all over the internet the second my heart stopped beating. But don't worry, they're really hot. So everyone will think it's cool. Ah, oh, fuck off! Douglas, how does it feel having the very troops you trained turn against you? Attempting to kill their own mentor. How poetic to die at the hands of your own students. They remember how badly you tortured them, you know. And they can't wait to get payback. There's more guys! Why are you getting into my business? It's fine.
wanna go to Applebee's? Still alive, are you? I should have known it was you. It could only have been you! How moronic of me to assume otherwise! You're the most obvious suspect. Nebulon! Wow, the twists keep coming! Nebulon, you've been here from the start. Garmantuous's favorite right-hand man. You always hated the attention he gave me. You wanted them all for yourself. And truth be told, I always was scared of you. Can't imagine the evils you're capable of. I'm not sure I can defeat you. But I have to try! to serve in the G3, but it's another altogether component of body or psychology. I really didn't expect you when I was alive, but then you killed me. So it pains me, but I must kill you back. We're gonna get you, bounty hunter. You're a tough one, Nipulon. I'm throwing everything I have at you, but can you survive this entire base self-destructing? Okay, I'll have to remember to rig that up later and time it with this video. Note to self, rig up base to self-destruct. Rig up base to self-destruct. Rig up base, okay. Deadly poison gas, or is that just me? If you're still hearing this, you're taking a long time to fight this wave. Don't you be dead by now. Feel free to die.
I'm ready to give birth whenever. What's up? But don't forget about my dad. You look terrible. You've seen better days. Yeah, let's do this. Deadly poison gas I was just me for making you go through all of that. You can leave now. Have a good day. Giblets out. R.I.P. Giblets. Well, that was fun. We can get back out through the trap door. Let's scram. Another Gatlian. I think they called him Let's Do It. He was supposed to be a big deal on Gatlas, I guess. But you know me. 
I can't remember anything cool like that. It's fine. Is he even alive? You know what? Let's take him back to Gene. Gene knows. He can fix, get him all fixed up. We've got this. I just wanted to say, you know, today, today really meant a lot to me, and, um, uh, God, oh, this is so fucking hard. Um, your free trial of detective mode is up, so see you later, bye. Oh, thank God. Okay, Bounty Hunter, you go through the menus. You find that detective mode. You shut it the fuck off. Never again. Okay, I'm serious. Delete it. J delete it. And if we, if you can't do it, we, we, we go, we go to, you know, we, it's a whole mission. It'll be a whole DLC mission. Every last peso we've ever earned, we pay whoever it is to delete this fucking detective mode bullshit. You know, a whole DLC story about As it that, that we'll charge $45 for. And it'll only I be like an hour of content because fuck of you. Bitch! No, I'm just kidding. I'm Mission. kidding. I'm kidding. We wouldn't do that. We wouldn't do that. We're not gonna do that. Both the Fergals and the Gatlians. But now. All right. I Let me shit out a bunch of my kids walk. to help you fight. Those were nothing but dead ends. Humans, however, humans are going to change everything. Doctor Gurgla scared the hell out of me, even more than all the other scary shit around here. Look at that. You found Dr. Giblets all by yourself. See? It's not so easy figuring out where these bozos are. Let it go. Come on over. Let's bow wow. Okay, uh, so we did find Dr. Giblets. Um, he is dead, but we also found another Gatlian. Oh, shit. That's great. I, I I I don't know about that. I mean, he, he's he's not really functional. I don't I don't I don't, I don't think he's dead. But oh, god damn. Yeah, he's busted up real bad. What were they doing to him? Do you, do you think he's salvageable? Buddy, I'm not gonna promise you I can save him. That would be irresponsible of me. You would be careless to toy with your emotions like that. But yes, I can definitely fix it. Okay. Th thanks, Gene. But, you know, if, if it can't be saved, it, it wouldn't be, uh... What was that? Uh, nothing! I, 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 I was being shitty. You, you, you didn't hear me. You, I don't want you to hear me being shitty. Yeah, okay. Weird thing to say, but whatever. Sorry to change the subject, but, uh... Turn in your bounty real quick. I've got some good news and some bad news. Okay, come on over. Let me give you the news. All right, what do you got for us, Gene? All right, which do you want first? The good news or the bad news? Uh, ha. Huh. Okay, you want me to talk about something else? Like what? Shoes? Why? I, I have important information to share with you. I'm not just shooting the shit here for fun. Are you just trying to... Be annoying or mean or I mean, is this some kind of weird power move to try and teach me my place or something? Making me wait to tell you my important shit? Quit the head, look. I'm not playing along. Christ, kid. Good news or bad news? Make it quick. Hey, well, I lied, kid. I don't have any good news. I was hoping you'd just ask for the bad news and then you'd be so upset you'd forget to ask about the good news. Uh, I was trying to pull a fast one on you. And I failed. So, uh, this is pretty embarrassing. All right, here's the bad news. Lizzie's been gone for a while. It's probably nothing, and I'm obviously not actually worried or anything because I, I hate her. But, uh, you know, you, you might want to look into it, since she's your sister and all. Maybe check with Tweeg. He works at that Space Applebee's uptown. Uh, so, uh, yeah, that's everything. I'll work on getting us some new bounty leads if you want to go look for Lizzie. And, uh... I'm gonna see if I can fix up that busted Gatlian you saved. Jesus, that is a lot to take in, Gene. Hey, uh, Bounty Hunter, you mind if we leave the other Gatlians here with Gene and maybe we can go poke around for Lizzie and use that time to have a little chat with each other? You know, just you and me, uh, our favorite 
people, our favorite, uh, you and I, our best pals. Gary fell in love and broke his crown. And Jill came tumbling after Gary and Jill went up. To oh, sure, we can use a little break. It's nice to stretch out a bit, you know? Take a little nappy poo. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Change the channel, Gene, to porn. Have a good time, you two. We'll hold down the four. All right, bounty hunter, let's head to Applebee's and we're, we're, let's find your sister. All right, guns. No funny business while the bounty hunter's away. Look at us, just you and me again, you know, just like old times, like the dream. Did you uh, pick out all the decorations? They're, uh, they're nice. You know, I, 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 I don't hate them at least. Look at us, just you and me again, you know, just like old times, like the dream team, you know? Uh, so Applebee's, it's in the slums, which you, you know, you, you probably knew that. So your suit can point us in the right direction. So you take the lead, bounty hunter. You, you, you know, we'll talk with, you know, we'll, we'll, we're gonna, we're, we're gonna chat. It's gonna be good. It's gonna, it's all good. Don't worry about this. Don't get shooken up about this. I don't, I, there's no reason to be, uh, you know, d don't feel weird or anything. I'm not trying, you know what I mean? Hey, yo, discerning customer, would you be interested in some quote-unquote food? Hey, listen, I'm sorry about being weird uh, back there. It's back, just, well, oh, through, there's something I need right to tell you. Whew, this is, this is hard. Just give me a second. Oh, you got this, Kenny. Come on. What are you doing? Making it awkward. Get I know what you're thinking. Can I put a human in the brand new hyper No one can do it for you. All right, Kenny, you're talking to yourself now. They can hear you. It's not so hard. Just tell them everything. <laughs> you, you'd never judge me, right? I mean, we're such close partners at this point, you know? Like, nothing I could say could ruin that, right? <laughs> I'm just just kidding around. Just I'm just joking around. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm out of my body right now, I think. So, we are, so what are you? Some uh, we are kind of heading a bounty to hunter? Applebee's in the that's slums, cool. and that's where we're going to in the slums. Hey, buddy, you got a hundred pesos? I gotta get me some Fergals. Broken leg guy still here. See you later. Yeah. Hey, um, is the sludge toxic up there? You know, Gene said Tweak worked at Applebee's, right? So that is, that is a, makes a, that's a good place to start looking for your sister. Oh boy, okay, so that, um, that dying Gatlian that we saved, let's do it. Let's say we can fix him up and he, you know, back alive. The thing is, oh, okay, sorry, sorry. I, I'm just trying to figure out how to say this properly or, or, you know, like communicate, um, how we normally do, right? You know, the Gatlian we saved, let's do it. Uh, he knows some things about me that, that, that the others don't know. And it's, a, it's nothing too crazy, you know, it's, it, it, okay, no, it's, it's bad. It's really bad. Sorry, I don't mean to be cryptic. I'm just, oh, this is tough. You know, this is really hard. I, I just don't want you to hate me. We're like a drone. I'm worried about your sister. You, you think Twig is working today? Welcome to Applebee's. Table for two, right this way. Oh, uh, actually, we're wondering if someone named Tweeg is working today. He didn't show up for his shift, sorry. Do you still want a table? Um, you know what? You know what? Maybe this is a good spot to talk. Uh, yes. We, 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 will, we will take a table. A 
Enjoy your meal. Your waiter will be with you shortly. Thank you. Okay, listen, I I'm sorry for making us sit here at Applebee's. I know we're really focused on Lizzie, and that's kind of the important thing, but would you mind if I kind of got something off my chest here with you first? Okay, right. Look, I know you're worried about Lizzie, but... Okay, so you remember what happened on my home planet, Gatlas? It got taken over by the G3, like yours. You know, all my people got enslaved. Y y you remember that, right? You know all that, right? Sorry. Of course you do. Well, um, what if it was kind of, you know, just a little tiny bit entirely my fault? Uh, okay, I, I can see you're at a loss for words. I, I, I know how it sounds. I'm not the only reason the G3 invaded Gatlas. I'm just the only reason they even knew about it in the first place. Hey there, welcome to Applebee's. I'm gonna be your waiter for the day. Can I get you started with one of our signature cocktails? Uh, not, not now, please. We're, we're kind of busy here. Okay, sure thing. I'm gonna go ahead and get that in for you. Uh, thank you. Okay, bounty hunter, so l l let me explain. Gatlas was isolated on the far edge of an asteroid belt. We were completely untouched by the greater interstellar civilization, j just like your planet. But, you know, I, I wanted out. Like, I wanted to see the galaxy. I wanted to see what everything out there had to offer. That's when Rel Del Mar crashed his ship into our planet. He was this crazy smuggler. He, he'd been all over and he'd seen it all. And, 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 and after I helped him fix his ship, he wanted me to be a part of his crew, you know? And he, he took me with him. And I'm back. Here we go. This is for you. All right, now what were you thinking for an appetizer? Uh, I'm sorry. We're in the middle of something, please. Great, it's coming right up. Oh, I don't know why I picked Applebee's to tell you this, but where, where were we? Okay, oh, right, um, obviously a guy like Rel, you know, he had to deal with all kinds of shady customers, and well, you know, that led us to the G3, and Garmantuous, you know, he'd never seen an alien like me, you know, a talking gun with endless firepower, and well, looking back, you know, I see how stupid I was, you know, I, I really do, but at the time, I couldn't tell, you know, I was being taken advantage of. I was going nowhere. You no, know, everyone thought I was a fuck up. You know, I, I just wanted to prove to everyone that I could do something, you know? Open up. Here comes the appetizer train. Chicka, 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 choo choo. Thank you. I ho hope you like those. Now you better be ready to order that main course. You betcha. I'm going to get that order right to the cook. Okay, thank you. So. I led the G3 right to Gatlas. Do you see where I'm going with this? We fought them off at first, you know, but they came back with some super virus that damn near zombified everyone. You know, a few of us were immune. We formed a rebellion. It was led by Les Do It. He was my best friend, my mentor. He was one of the strongest Gatlians who ever lived, and I, I got him killed. In his dying moments, I told him everything, like I'm telling you now, about how I left Gatlas to pal around with a criminal, how I led Garmantuous and the G3 right to our planet, how I got everyone killed, except Les Do It survived. Somehow, the G3 must have kept him alive to try to utilize his power. God, if we can really bring him back, do, do, do you see my problem, right? Like, I, I'm gonna have to tell the other guns what I did, you know, or else he'll tell them. All right, I'm back. Hope those tummies are ready for some yummies. Bon appetit. Dude, take a fucking hint. Can't you see we're in the middle of a thing here? Emotional thing. Uh, you know, this is important baggage shit we're dealing with here. Take a hint and get out of here for a second. Uh-oh, someone's feeling grumpy. Oh, wonderful. Now, wh what the fuck is happening outside? Lizzie? Don't follow us. Twig and I are in love, and we're going to travel the galaxy in his space RV. Uh, actually, this is moving kind of fast. Not Help me, please. Not that sentence. We're in okay, love. we gotta get to them. Oh, shit, yeah. We I can't dine and dash. I love this place. Don't want to get blacklisted. Oh fuck, okay, this, this this changes shit, this is bad. I'm here. 
are live in downtown Blim City, where, as you can see, we've been invaded by violent and agitated G3 cartel forces. No one can say for sure why they're here. We're here to kill you, bounty hunter! <laughs> ah, okay. Well, there you have it. It looks like this is only a problem if you are that bounty hunter that they're trying to kill. I'm People Fuckerton, Blim City News. Stay safe out there. Work base inbound! Hey, uh, so I've got some more bad news. Uh, you were doing such a good job. job at all these bounty hunting rights. You really were, so I made some new commercials with you in them to drum up more business and, well, let's just say they the house address and now the G3 knows where we are, so they're attacking the house. So get back here quick, or they're gonna kill me and the other guy. My bad. Fucking as if it couldn't get any worse! Remember before the jetpack when we, we had to just walk around like assholes? Fuck that shit. Ow, I know this is hurting you too, so get the fuck out of this shit! That's tugging on my nerve endings. You gotta try this Gatorol sometime. It, it, it might kill you though, that's the only thing. Whip out knifey! Just what the doctor ordered. God, I hate those fuckers! Should have joined up with the bad guys. Out of my heart, damn I mean, you can, but it sucks. I, I really hate it. But if you get so good, you fuck. We're fighting everybody. ones, you know? Another wave? Are you kidding me? You are always in some kind of rush, aren't you? I'm not judging. I'm just, just, just observing. Nice moves! Holy shit, they're fucking everywhere! Get to the house! Come on! We gotta get to the fucking house! Surprised to see me, bounty hunter! <laughs> you fuck with the wrong crime syndicate. It's all over. Hand over the galleons you stole from us, and then let me heal you. Nice and easy. We know everything about you. 
and we still have two oh-so-special people who are very worried about you. <laughs> Turn yourself in and nobody has to get hurt. We had to let Gene use us. Thanks for coming back for me. I didn't deserve your help. It's not your fault. Well, no, you don't fuck that. It is your fault. You fucked up enormously, but we'll deal with that later. Please, fire up the warp core. We're leaving. What's the plan? Yeah, the warp's ready, but where can we go where the G3 won't follow? I'll handle that. Can you pull off a Hennison maneuver mid-warp to juke them? Can I what? Did you make that up? You mean scramble the warp? Fine, yes, yeah, scramble the warp. Bounty hunter, bring me to the warp core. Listen carefully and enter these exact coordinates. 862135-0 capital G lowercase x dash W W capital both C4 567 capital 5892-174222-65344. Fuck these are long coordinates. This is why no one types space coordinates in manually. Fucking 555, that's right. Of the 43-211874. Got it. Scramble time. And here we go. Fuck. That was close. I may be 230, but I don't want to die yet. Are we? Did, did we make it? Yeah. We're safe. Nobody on our tail, but, uh... Where are we? Am I missing something? I'm not picking up any signs of life out there. Then we're in the right spot. Kenny, where did you just take us? It was the only safe place I could think of. Careful. It's toxic out there. I set up an atmos bubble so you can breathe, so... Don't wander too far. Or do. What does it matter anymore? Hold on. I need a minute to get my heart rate back down. Why don't you take a look outside and get your bearings? Welcome to Gatlas, my home planet. Jesus. I didn't realize it was this bad. Fuck, there's nothing left. This was our home? Pretty soon Earth is gonna look like this too. We have got to stop the G3, bitch. Sorry, nobody answered me. I asked if this was our home. Anyone? Oh, you, you, oh, thank God. The fucking made it uninhabitable. Fine, I don't need an answer. God, yes, creature. It, it was our home and it got all fucked up. We're, we're, we're trying not to think about it too much. Got it, thank you. Well, it looks like shit. So humans sleep on big fluffy rectangles? Nah, I'm just fucking with you. I know what a toilet is. I'm just fucking with you, man. I, I, again, on top of that, I, I know that's a bed. Calm down. I'm not a fucking idiot. How is it out there? We, we, we don't want to talk about it. That bad, huh? Well, uh, don't get all depressed about it. We still got more guys out there to kill. Let's powwow real quick. Look, I hate to be pushy, but are you ready for your next bounty? You know what, kid? Maybe you should get some rest. Let's save the bounty hunting for tomorrow. 
Head on upstairs. I'll take care of things down here. I hate to say it, but Jean's right. Let's get some shut eye. We'll make this right starting tomorrow. Lips controls. And like don't worry about your sister. I'm I'm looking for her. I mean, don't get me wrong, she sucks and I hate her and I hope she dies, but uh well, you seem pretty torn up about her. I'll make some calls and find her. I promise. I am so learned in the amorous art that when men I crush to my dreaded heart. Alright, good night. So. Alright, you're finally up. Okay, let's get back to it, I guess, you know? I, I, I hope Gene has a lead on Lizzie. Let's go. Yeah, look who finally decided to wake up. You know how late it is? Because I don't. There's no sun on this dead rock of a planet. By the way, I got you a little something something. A new suit upgrade. Extra overshield. You're welcome. Yeah. This, this alien has legs. He has legs. There's no way he, he pulled those bodies out here by himself. That's just impossible. Look at, look here, look at this. He didn't crawl or anything. This guy has legs. Man, he's really pulling it, really trying to trick these guys. These kids, fucking alien, bro. Let's get to business. I've got something you like. You can breathe easy. I'll get right to it. I tracked down Lizzie's bio signal. Oh, that's great. So, so she's... She's alive. Don't worry. But she's on the move. Probably on a ship, so we have to act fast or we'll lose her. If you're ready, just step through the portal door. I have no idea what's on the other side of that portal. Be prepared for anything. Good luck. Alright, let's go find our stupid sister. I don't know what I want. Okay, fine, I don't know either! Isn't the sex good? I don't know. I can't even tell if we're doing it right. We're aliens. None of our shit even lines up correctly. You could be pregnant and I would fucking wonder how that happened. My cum goes all over outside of your body. Well, okay. I don't know if it's good either. Your body is really confusing. God, I'm just so confused. Aren't we in love? You're asking me that? Dude, you're the one who dragged me out on this trip. I wasn't looking for anything serious. I just wanted to get laid. But even that turned out to be some weird fucking Hellraiser puzzle. Oh, shut up. Don't blame this on me. There's plenty of ways you could have figured out how to use my equipment, so to speak. Hey, uh, sorry to interrupt. Oh, yeah, thank God. You came just in time to save me. Me is who you came to save. Thank you. Fuck your sister, dude. Woo! Cuckoo! Girls, am I right? Love is tough. What the fuck are you doing here? Uh, I don't know. We were a little worried about you. God, everyone needs to chill out. When have you smoked? What, you're a smoker now? Wait, what is it? Camels? Marble, 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 marbleos? Marlboro, marble, marbleos? Marlboros? I don't know. What's it to you? What do you want? Well, I don't want to come home. It's not even my home anymore. It's Jean's jack-off mansion, and it's your little clubhouse where you can unwind for a few minutes between bouts of, oh, I don't know, murdering criminal gang lords. Hey, I'll go home. You can take me home. How about that? I'm your new sister. Congratulations. Just get me the fuck out of here. No, you're staying, Tweek. We're in love. Say it. Say we're in love. Okay. Never mind. I can't go. 
I have to be in love with your sister. Look, I hate to be insensitive, but it's dangerous out in space for humans right now. We even got chased out of Blimp City by the G3. Whoa, really? Yeah, it was rough. Listen, I get that there's a lot right now that's bothering you, but can we convince you at least to just come home with us and figure it out there? But I'm busy being in love with Tweeg. Uh, yeah, we're busy. Sorry. So just leave, unless... What else were you worried about? Oh yeah? How? Yeah, how about you just let me handle this on my own? You already decided to become a weird alien-killing expert. Don't strain yourself trying to be a dating expert, too. Um, yeah, no offense, but you're kind of butting in, dweeb. Hey, only I can talk to them that way. And look, I'm sorry I dragged you out here. Really, I am. I know you didn't want to. But I just, I wanted to know for sure if, if we worked or not. Oh, yeah, it's cool. I forgive you. I just think, oh, oh, really? Even after forcing you to leave with me? Yeah, okay, it's fine, yeah. Did you know I almost sold you out to the G3? They were offering, like, a lot of pesos to find out where you were. And that would have been way worse. What the fuck, Twig? You piece of shit. Wait, what? You're joking, right? No, I really almost did it. Like, I had my phone out and everything. If Lizzie hadn't dragged me on this trip, I probably would have. I'm not good. I'm a shithead. Lizzie shouldn't be dating me, Gene was right. And it's a little fucked up because he was being a misogynist, but he was actually right. I do suck, and I'm fine with it. That's just who I am, and I love it. So fuck off, love it. Sue me if you don't like it, but good luck finding a judge who'll take that case, or a lawyer, fuck it, you're a fucking idiot. Well, Jesus, I was about to do a, a whole thing about how we should take a step back and slow things down, but you know what? Fuck you, Tweek. Yeah, uh, yeah, Tweek, fuck you! Hey, thanks for coming to get me. Seriously, it, it means a lot. Uh, okay, enough. Let's go. You got it! Smell you later, Tweek. Can I kill him now? I'll stab him. Piece of shit. Hey, you guys are welcome back whenever you want to come back. If it, I mean, fucking five minutes from now you can come back. I don't give a shit. I ain't coming back, bro. I just want. We're not coming back, idiot. Mm. Just want to kill you, dumbass. We're back. You're safe. Uh, I mean, fuck you. And a fuck you too. Okay, happy reunion. Everyone's fine. Can, can we just get back to bounty hunting? Yeah, 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 yeah. Clug just sent over the data on Nipulon, so you can head out while I fix Les to it. Did you, uh, know how much firepower this guy's packing? He's got to be at least ten times as powerful as any of you other Gatlians. Wait, you really think you're going to be able to fix him? Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably have them all patched up by the time you get back. Y you're serious? That, that, that soon? Yeah. Don't worry about it, kid. Your friend's gonna be just fine. Old Papa Gene watched a bunch of GooTube tutorials, and now he knows his way around cybernetics. That's 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 great. It's it's just what you don't sound too happy. You know how hard I've been working to save this guy. Fuck. Whew. Okay. I guess it's now or never, bounty hunter. Can you set the other guns down on the table for me, real quick? Hey everybody, I, I I need to come clean about, uh, well, sh phew, this is f way tougher than I thought. Spit it out! Yeah, spit it out! No, I I, I can't, I, you're gonna hate me. Dad, th we, we don't have secrets. We're a family! Well, hold on, I might decide to hate him. It's okay, Kenny, you can tell us. Oh, just fucking say it. Okay, fine. If you don't hear it from me, you're just gonna hear it from Les Dewitt when he wakes up. Okay, what if I were to tell you that I'm the reason the G3 invaded Gatlas and enslaved our race? We'd be mad. I, I don't think I could get over it. Yeah, don't say that. You know what? It would really suck to hear you say Kenny, that. Kenny, come on. That's not true, right? No, no, no. That would be impossible. Are you doing a bit? Okay, well, there's, there's more to the story than just oh, a... fuck. He's scrambling for words. It really is true. He really did cause the downfall of our civilization. Kenny, how? That doesn't even make sense. 
How can it be your fault? I left Gatlas before the G3 invaded. But, but how could that be possible? We didn't even have interstellar travel on Gatlas yet. I ran into an alien smuggler who crashed his ship on our planet, and I was going nowhere, and, and, and he took me with him on these adventures, and it was supposed to be, you know, this fun, awesome thing, and but then we got mixed up doing the wrong job with the wrong crowd. Garmantuous and the G3, and I accidentally led them right to Gatlas. It all happened so fast, I, I thought they killed Let's Do It. I, I told him everything as I watched the light leave his eyes. I didn't know he I didn't know he was gonna survive. You mean you didn't think you'd ever have to tell us the truth? No, 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 that's not it. I, I... Oh, This is all sorts of fucked up, Kenny. I don't even know what to say. See? I'm not the biggest fuck up here. Not now, dude. Everyone, please. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I didn't know what I was doing. We're so close to taking down the G3. Let's just... Oh, okay, let's just pretend you're not the reason everyone we know and love is dead, yeah? Sure, easy, done. What's next on the agenda? Forgive Garmantuous too? Come on, th 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 that's not fair. Don't fight. I'm sure we can all figure this out. No, Creature, he can't just drop that bomb on us and expect everything to be the same. I I'm sorry. Look, I hate to be this guy, but we're running out of time. Nipulon may not stay where he is for long, so I know things aren't... The ideal, but, uh... Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll finish the job. And then you're out of our lives, Kenny. Come on, Sweezy, you don't mean that. Enough! Just pull yourselves together for this mission, at least. You're professionals! You're bounty hunters! Act like it! Mm-hmm. Fine. <laughs> okay, yeah. Gather everyone up. It's time to get back on track. Nipulon just flew back into his drug lounge on Port Tarine, so we gotta strike now. Can you handle that? She meanwhile with strawberry lips can Let's just get this over with. And like an ass writhing on burning coals. Moist on my lips. And I can lull to sleep thine ancient conscience in my couches deep. I am so learned of the amorous art. That when men I crush to my dreaded heart. Or to their mumbling kisses bear my body. So fair. So bold. So shy. And so robust that impotent angels damn themselves for me. I guess that really puts things into perspective. Hey, thanks again, and good luck. Stay safe out there. Woof, that was a doozy, huh? It's just one thing after another, isn't it? I don't know about all that, but uh, I'm glad you got your sister back. Thanks for doing that. Another talking gun? What's wrong with this one? My brain's all fucked up beyond repair. I'm creature. A girl in every port, and this is the first port I've seen. You know, I don't think you know. I'm feeling okay. Thanks again for coming to get me. I'll be fine. I promise. So what? You're almost done offing G3 dickheads, right? That's insane. You're like totally legit at this point. I'm honestly pretty proud of you. Good luck. You'll be dreaming about it all the way back to San Francisco. Why don't we just stow these bags in the barracks and, uh, hit the town? I'm with you. Okay. Man, are we lucky to be stationed here? Yes, we are. Would you look at this place? It's fantastic. You know, this is the Paris of the Orient. I bet you could find anything you wanted on this street, just like Eddie said. Betty said it. You can bet your bottom dollar on it being here. Oh, yeah, Chief wouldn't steer us wrong, man. Nope. Nope. You know, that one's always looking out for us. That is? Uh, somebody has to. Huh? Would you like living here, Bounty Hunter? Would this place be cozy for you? Thanks for saving all of us, but you didn't have to save my cousin Bill. He's a real piece of shit. You know, this place is getting a little crowded. I can't find my wife. My husband is still out there somewhere. Please save him. I don't love him or anything, but he owes me $12. 
Yeah, do you know when we're going to be allowed to go back to Earth? They don't tell us anything. Have you met Owen Wilson yet? Here's a hot tip. He's usually hanging out in the sex room. You know, that famous Owen Wilson might just be able to hook us up with a free screening of Drillbit Taylor. It's really cool that we're in space, but wish it were under better circumstances. If I were to find out that my dear wife died, you know, I just might try to marry Owen Wilson. Oh, no, 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 it's fine here. So I guess we're like in space or something? Oh no, it may look terrible, but it's fine here. I myself think Wedding Crashers was a landmark film achievement. Doesn't get enough talk as far as I'm concerned. Why, I could watch Wedding Crashers all day and night. Little underrated if you ask me. You know, it's a this darn shame so much Owen than my Wilson on doesn't Earth. act I as much anymore. Where the AC didn't even work. Damn, our planet getting taken over by aliens is the best thing that's ever happened to me. Maybe after this whole invasion thing is over, we'll get back to the acting. She, meanwhile, with strawberry lips cajoles, and like an asp writhing on burning coals. Moist on my lips, and I can go to sleep thine ancient conscience in my couches deep. I hey, in the event that I manage to get Lizdwit back online, we'll be ready to fight Garmantuous. And for that, you're really gonna need those Earth coordinates. Nipulon should have them logged somewhere in his office, in that big drug lounge he runs. Find those if you can, so we can take the fight to Garmantuous back on your home planet and finish this. Alright, so this is where I'm going to end the okay, video. Okay, why didn't you tell me you had the sickest bedroom ever? Yeah, so this is where I'm going to end the video, if you like the videos please remember to like share and subscribe and guys goodbye for now and i'll see you in the next one